Uh, welcome to another episode of Conversation Square where we have deep, honest, intelligent conversations about things that matter to us. And with us today is these two amazing friends of mine and we're going to touch a bit on uh, on the good and the bad of social media. So most of you guys are ever on social media that is YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, you know snapchat you know and we have tinder. more coming up and tinder <laughs> and, we have, <laughs> and we have new ones coming up every day so what are the good and the bad of them so in each in everything there's a good and the bad of it so we've seen or we've all experienced the beauty and maybe some of you have also experienced the bad bit of of social media so we're going to touch on our experiences that's the good and the bad mm-hmm. uh of our um, so all of us here are all in at least we have accounts in at least three social media uh platforms let's start with facebook i think facebook was my first way back in 209 mm-hmm. i think when i was in from from one Ooh, ah, i was back so from one <laughs> where kama, kama you don't want people to know you are 99 <laughs> <shidak. laughs> no, imagine lena kwa cyber is a friend of mine at kanza account so uh, i think most of us will end on facebook and then after facebook after you're all grown to can acquire twitter back then what we're gonna shift from like the grown-ups were shifting from facebook to twitter ah. and then we came the grown-ups the bourgeoisie oh your house <laughs> and your house <laughs> intelligent people mm-hmm. and, they, and they couldn't deal with the kids on facebook and then we have instagram and then of course we have youtube i think those are my most i tried snapchat oh and media. whatsapp so whatsapp is actually my number one i think whatsapp was my number one and of course to me on our whatsapp we could grow from back then we looking by to watch a message before the groups came i have groups in like 100 members to i think to me yeah. yeah so to me grow to me to me talk about it, yes. i think i think to come back yeah. so apart from those ones are you do you have an account in any of any other um, social media platforms like snapchat um, i think currently i'm checking out reddit oh reddit yes and you <laughs> yes reddit and you uh, social media yeah i'm i'm on facebook i'm on instagram I'm on LinkedIn. Oh yes, LinkedIn. Oh, LinkedIn yeah. for the professionals. Yes, yes. You know, that's how important it is. the problem with these professionals like LinkedIn. Is mm. Either you know how to use it or you don't. Some don't of us have, have Twitter, profiles, yes. but we have never been given work. We are pretty close to being given work in Africa. Kuna kazi hapo. Actually, someone was telling me about LinkedIn. Mm-hmm. That yeah. I think I think it's where the setting and the culture of this of the of the country where mm-hmm. you're in, yeah. there are some countries that actually they go through your LinkedIn your account LinkedIn. Oh. and they hire through LinkedIn oh. alone. Uh, There's no a physical dropping of mini series. Oh, they go through LinkedIn. LinkedIn. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. That's why there's also, also a premium for LinkedIn. Oh, you yeah. Pay yet. Oh, yeah. I think, pay, pay I think I've also seen when you apply a job in some of these global companies, they ask instead of a CV. Yes. Or, or maybe they have an option of sharing your LinkedIn account. Mm, Assuming yeah, that your CV will be a photo. Like whatever is on your CV will be on your LinkedIn account. Yes. So, but your LinkedIn, I think you have to keep updating it every time. The same way you do your yes. it's like, like an online CV. It's a, it's a good way of selling so yourself. Good... That is... <laughs> That's another way. That's, a, that's yes. the good side of social media. No, it's but, really good to that. But the good thing is that you, you've already made yeah, it in that. life. A lot of people go through your LinkedIn. One of the other is an intern. Okay. <laughs> You either know how to do it or you don't. Or you don't. Mm. Okay, Some of us just have profiles. Okay, so mm. I think I also tried Snapchat and you're like, I, I can't. Like, this, this, <laughs> let, like I think I deleted the account. Like, I can't just deal with it. What have been the, the advantages or the beauty of social media since you started? So that one. The beauty of social media, yeah. I think it Like your own you personal experience. My own personal experience. I think or it's given experience. me mm-hmm. much exposure. Okay. And also the friends that you get from social media. It's not social media. Social yeah. media. From social media. Actually, for I've seen people who started dating for social from yeah, social media married. and they got married, yeah. and also there are people who've gotten work through social media. Yeah, true. Like yes. Twitter, Ikokazi, there's a hashtag. And also, I think yeah. for social media, having that network it builds for you that network. Yeah. However, it also has its own cons. Cons, so yeah, can, true. Yes, for yeah. later discussion, yeah. Yeah. So I think I think one of the benefit as as a as an as a owner of an online shop, I think. When it comes to business, social media has been the greatest yes. and the best thing ever. Because I run my, 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 my business specifically on online, you know. Of course, there are those people that you find, the clients you find on online, and then you later maybe just communicate on phone. But mm. you get them from, from social media accounts. And that's also why maybe a friend of yours will share a picture wearing or, you know, wearing maybe one of your products, and then they copy you. 
and then you know someone else will see that so i think business wise i think social media has been the best i think the best thing that has ever happened to, to like to this generation because mm-hmm. you have companies still running like full companies that just operate on social media accounts even the social media platform themselves those are like also they're like businesses the owner or the co-founder of Facebook is one of the greatest features people in the world. So I think it has really helped the business communities. Even the traditional businesses, we've seen them, of course, if they haven't by now gone the digital way, then they're probably closing down. Yeah. If you look at the statistics of the number of people owning smartphones nowadays. It's a huge, huge number. Yeah, it's a huge number, yes. Even we also have influencers. We just wake up in the morning, they take pictures go to a restaurant, take pictures with the food and get paid for that. Those to get paid for such posting. So I think it's also been a great um, creation of employment for, for so many people. Yeah, I think you... Uh, I think for the most part it's what it was originally meant for it's yeah. connecting, with having people. a connected world. So yeah, guess, sure. yeah, yeah, more and more it's, that's the importance of it, I would say. Yeah. That we have been able to connect with people who previously you wouldn't, have. Sending, yeah, you wouldn't have yeah today literally family groups are run from social media so, yeah family events are organized on social media yeah, baby yeah. showers baby showers <laughs> <laughs> and i also think i think there's also of course there's the, that disconnecting bit of the, the social media yes. all disconnects people like physical disconnection but i also think you know you're able to if you have relatives in the village or you know maybe abroad you're able to talk you know on whatsapp and make a call which is very very cheap and or very very affordable and like before it will probably take you months before you got a letter from you know from maybe mm-hmm. if you're in school in nairobi and maybe your parents are back at shop it will take you ages and ages before your your mom knows hey will you shula salam mm-hmm. <laughs> by the time by the time the letter gets to your to your mom, kusha funga shule loko jumbani. So I think has it has really helped communication. Yeah, that's that's in it's, terms of global yeah. village. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Global a global. Village. I think yeah. it's more like of how you decide to use it. Then that's where um, you get to benefit more or less. Uh, yes, or, or less from it. Yeah, in terms of using the social media, you can use it for for your own good. Some people have used it to scale. In terms yeah. of their business and also their life yeah true. because for some people you find that for their life is purely social media yeah true yeah nowadays you find that someone wakes up because they can go to twitter because yeah. they can i think even in most corporates nowadays yeah. they have also acknowledged that they have a pr team that yeah. does that yeah so no no yes we are having an event digital today. strategist or something yes yeah. we have an event and we have to trend it gives people that yeah. mileage yeah, yeah. Of, of being in a certain state yeah true. In, in terms of the being in the social uh, yeah. social lights i think yeah. also they want to making millions here. Yes, people are making. It's employment. Yeah, it's employment <laughs> actually. Go <laughs> 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 You become more informed because of social media. You learn so many things, things that you never learn at home, yeah. in school, at church. You learn them on social media. You know, things to do with content, things to do with gender equality, things to do what's happened. I think we a couple of times we recommended each other maybe accounts that we are following yeah. on Twitter or Instagram or like certain videos we watch on YouTube that are very informative. You know, things that probably we don't know that they they exist in Kenya. I think there's a video about on BBC. It was about uh, drug queens, yeah. drug, drug 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 queens in Kenya. And I was like, oh, I didn't know we have drug drug queens in Kenya. Mm. So if I had not seen that on you know on Twitter, I could I couldn't have known. Mm. So it has become very very informative. We also learn a lot. You also learn, you know, what's happening out there in the world, the new trends that are happening. Yeah, yeah so I think yeah. information, which you know, is information media, is power. It, it, it has given each and everyone a voice. Yes. As much as you own that phone, yeah. you have a voice. Yeah. yeah. So each and every person can at least say his or her own opinion. Yeah. However, also people need to be cautious. In to terms be cautious of, of what you're saying. Yes. Especially cautious, sharing information about sharing other information. There's so much information out there. Yeah. But, but so it's not authentic. Yes, so saving, saving that information and to remain with the... Uh, I think so. Not, that's the downside of social media. Yeah. It, can, it can ruin a credibility, trust credibility. Yeah. Yeah. So there are so many downsides of social media that can really, it really comes with social media. Yeah. But so it also, just as you say, it's about how you use it. Yeah. Yes. I think we've seen so many people, even companies that have been destroyed on social media because either some of them are facts or some of them are that's why i'm saying advocacy or even being in fall or something people now have a voice before you probably report maybe a rape case or a harassment case to the police will take care of this. so maybe you don't even have the the courage to report someone because someone is influential then you go to somewhere like like twitter and then share your story and then that person probably arrested or because i've also seen you know the institutions like 
their DCIM, you know, calling out for, maybe they're looking for this particular person who was caught doing something like a crime. Yeah. And then after just a few hours, people come, come and I'm like, hey, he's my neighbor, he's Ako mm-hmm. you know? <laughs> so I think it has also helped, um, as you say, people people to have a voice also. Yes. It has also, also brought down companies and individuals that uh, should be down there and shouldn't be existing. But it has also also destroyed people because of false information. Also, yeah. people trying to to look for fame in the yeah, in the wrong. False information yeah, so we've seen. Kind of yeah, yeah, true. So, so we've also so seen people being destroyed. That people who don't deserve to be destroyed on yeah. social media. There's also an aspect of cyberbullying. Yes. Oh. Cyberbullying. I, I don't know. So yeah, we've been cyberbullying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not yet that influential. <laughs> Fortunately, <laughs> not yet. I don't know. Not yet. I think I've, actually people. I, I let me tell you. You know, I've seen because I follow. I some of I, I also I'm very vocal with some of these things, but when like having conversation like with my friends, I'll be very, very vocal. But then there are things I'm like, oh, I don't check my vocalness on Twitter, and then someone takes it, you know, completely Personal. opposite of what I meant, or because there's no room for me to like explain what I meant, like second, like just, just crazy things happen. So I prefer not to take part some of this conversation that I wish I can. Uh, but we've seen, we've seen people being attacked because of their looks, especially when it comes to women, yeah. uh, you know, body image. And a, and a lot of people have come up to say, yes, I've been cyberbullied before. You know, you say something and then people attack you. Like people from nowhere, people you don't even know, people they feel entitled. Yes. I know. And then even the people who choose to put their lives out there, like if you're maybe a, a, a vlogger and you decide to share images of, of your partner, Especially, you know, these couple goals. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> couple so goals. Couple goals. <laughs> couple goals. Unfortunately. I mean, well, I, I, I'm here to join the hashtag. <laughs> the hashtag. Yeah. Couple, couple goals, gym, whatever. <laughs> anyway, w- w- have you seen, have you seen um, someone being cyberbullied or had someone share their story about their cyberbullying? I think cyberbullying is, it's always there. Like, every day you look, it's there. And I yeah. think... Uh, one comedian uh, in one of their stand-up comedies yeah. was saying that the problem today with this, uh, and especially why even people get bullied on a daily yeah. basis is yeah. the society has become so political. Yeah, that, in everything. Yeah, everything. That like today I could yeah. wake up in the morning on on Twitter and, and say and tweet out and say milk is white yeah. and there's someone who will take offense. Mm. They eat. True. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You I like no. It's exactly. Not. You. you, you yeah, milk. You, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> you, you could even tweet out today that. Uh, uh, actually, they'll be like that. You know, water is life. Uh, and there's someone who will take yeah. offense. Yeah. yeah. Everyone, they'll be everything. like no, 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 everything no. You're destroying the environment. Poli- exactly. Everything has become political. Yeah. So true. I think that has also propagated. It just yeah. proves that we are political. I think. I think so. But also, I think. You know, one thing, one thing I always say, if you if you, you are part of that social media, you have to be, have a certain level of confidence, because whatever may come, come, like come falling on you may just destroy. I don't even know what I'm saying. But, and yeah. so, <laughs> so he has seen my Facebook DM a couple of times. <laughs> ah, I swear. Uh-huh. Ah, let me tell you. Uh-huh. The ladies. I, I would say the ladies out here are uh, suffering. Like like uh, <laughs> suffering. <laughs> I, 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 I think it has gotten to a point. Mm. It is all. It is. I think it is now enough to to like declare it an epidemic. I like, swear. Especially, I, I think yeah, on 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 this yeah on Facebook. Facebook. I think I've, Facebook I've seen it. Yeah. Uh, I think Instagram. I'm also seeing a couple of them coming, but I always block them. So my Facebook uh, DM okay, is wh- full of. Wh- what what's the motive? You know, DMing <laughs> is not bad. No, no, it's not even DM. No, it's, it's not DM. It's what being sent on it's that DM. The, the case of content. unsolicited uh, what are they called? Unsolicited dick pics that I are being know. sent out. Like. Let me tell you. I think <laughs> why like you literally can pick your Indians. Like you literally, you literally pick. I don't. You, you I don't. Literally know what say. You literally <laughs> pick a lady's phone uh, uh, and you go through their DMs. Just, Four out of five. Yeah. They are dick, they dick just pictures. Dick pics. Uh, mm-hmm. And then the one that is not, it's someone, it's someone. And actually, someone, yeah. It's a, and actually, it's someone, the one, the one that is not, bad. is they they're, they're either saying something bad. Yeah. Or they have sent you uh, a picture and you didn't reply. Eh? Yeah. Yes. So, so my, my Facebook DM, I'll show you one day, mm. but I, I never ever try, like I never go to my Facebook, like the kind of big pictures I've seen, I think they will sustain me for the rest of my life, like, <laughs> I'm like, no, I'm like, no, please. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and then you send all, you know, you've seen, like, 
I think because I think when you started on Facebook, you used to get excited you find so many friend requests. Mm. So you just accept without hey, confirming yeah. who it is. Then I think there was a point I had, I had like uh, maybe 5k uh, Facebook mm. and then friend almost half of them. Do you know how traumatizing it is? I don't because know. Because no. I've never received it. <laughs> <laughs> like you guys don't get like and then you can imagine from chicks. And then, listen, and then you can imagine we are not that lucky. <laughs> this is not lucky. Like, this, this is a curse. Like, no, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. This okay, is a curse. Like, uh, listen, and then uh, we're going to say you can imagine that today it's not like when you are signing up for social media. Yeah. It's not like uh, like you are going to maybe sign up for Impesa where. Yeah. Someone, ha- you have to prove that 18 and above. Yeah, you so can. you can imagine, probably there are kids out there mm. who, with yeah, accounts with who are 13, 14, yeah, true, true. who are receiving. Even, yeah, and, and and these guys are just sending them. They're just sending them I out. Swear, so they, I yeah? swear. But I didn't know, yeah. from my ignorance, yeah. mm. or because I don't watch porn, or I don't even care about the the porn industry, mm. or I care mm. anyway, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> I learned that people actually watch proper porn on Twitter. I was like, no, Twitter, I don't know. Twitter, Twitter is a porn, what is it called? It's a porn website, essentially. If you I know, don't you know. know. If you don't so know, you I don't did know. go searching, like, out of yeah. curiosity, what happened yeah. in the longer this person is lying? Yeah. Uh, well, Shock on you. Shock on me. Cool, <laughs> people are going to be tweeting the whole time, and people. <laughs> So yeah, I don't think that's the another downside of social media. Controlling oh, that's that. Control, it's very hard to control. No, but then is it? You need to so that's what I'm saying. Like, mm. is it? It's a downside. Yes, in the sense that. But there's someone else. It's an upside for someone. Exactly, else. it's an upside yeah. for someone else. So the one somebody is you. Yeah. Yeah, okay. it's a downside, on from your point of view. Yeah. But then it's an upside. From the person who is at the other end of the, the receiving, the receiving end. end. Oh, okay. Okay. When you look at it from a utilitarian mm-hmm. point of view, which yeah. is, which calls for mm-hmm. for you don't do harm yeah. to the other person. Yeah. Maybe something that's meant to harm the other person. Yes, you don't do something that's meant to harm. Like for her, she says she's she was traumatized. She's traumatized. Then, you know, am I, I traumatized? Am I just even... making it up? No, you've seen you've seen you've seen. Was she like... traumatized? No, but then, but then, but then, who is to blame for that? No, no, that's the question. So, yeah. Is, so, am I not a person getting traumatized because of that? So, I think trolling. You need to trolling. I stop. Yes. Yay! Okay, but I am. Well, me, I've, I've, I've searched for my crushes and stuff on uh, social media. So, uh, but that's a very good thing. Because you know you don't go on a date <laughs> with maybe someone who has been accused of sexual harassment mm. or maybe corruption. I'm an imuizi. A lot of the day the police get them, they're on a date also, with you. Then you both get <laughs> arrested. You know, yeah. so no, no. So you have to be very, that's also helped. That. Actually, it helps in terms of. For me, I usually, I usually call it profiling. Yeah, thank yeah. you. You profile someone. You want to know them. Even yes. even when you're looking for a job, you go on social media mm. to find out. So these guys, what do they? What exactly do they do? What are their employee policies? Even, mm. even now, you you search to say you want to get a job, you bring everything. So yeah. that's now that's the new with social media. Yeah. It's a beauty and also another thing. Yeah, social true. media, yeah. the internet never forget. Like with every social media site mm. platform. There is the good and the bad. There are those, there are those who use it for good and yeah. those who use it for bad. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, so what, what crazy? What crazy? Have you had any crazy experience on social media? On social media. Yeah. Crazy. Define crazy. Born. <laughs> Nude. Maybe too. Maybe you're going through social media, then you stumble on such. Oh so, yeah. By yeah. mistake. So you expose things that intentionally you're, you're just in your means. Anime. Then you stumble on what you didn't expect to, to find see. on social media yeah. because you, enjoy, you can't prevent because you're there. Yeah. Yeah. You're using social media. Yeah. So, the kid who is in any, you know, where is he? Where is You guys have, you guys have control, control of the kind of things you share on social media. Because I'm specifically, I don't share anything about my family on social media. I try as much as possible. And then because on, on Facebook, I had to go back and delete some of the pictures and content that I used to post because, you know, I was probably from one in high school, <laughs> posting everything about Wagwan yeah. and, 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 and dancehall music. And, and why are you discussing humble to... beginnings? <laughs> uh, yeah, why? <laughs> See, like, humble no, no, like, yeah, humble beginnings. Yeah, humble beginnings. Why are you? Why are you? Why are you? Why are you? That was the real you then. No, I'm grown. I'm no, but grown. Then, but then, of course you've grown. Yeah, even listen, listen, listen. of those companies no, that go back to your social media accounts. Listen, listen, listen. But does growth meaning? Yeah. 
right. erasing the past. So your next no. employer will actually appreciate after you 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 say like some very stupid. Okay, stupid. by now you you also think they're stupid things way back. So think you're more but then you know, listen, yeah, but then you know, proud, listen, but then you know, be being, 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 being wiser is not about. Yeah, being, no, ex, listen, being wiser is not about running. Ex. It's not about running away from yeah. who you are. It's about who are you back then. Yeah. Mm. And who are you now? Now, yes, yes. amazing thing. So no, I, I did. I At least you, 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 you compared, yes, you met him. You say yes. this is this is progress, <laughs> not perfection. <laughs> progress, not perfection. Yeah. yeah. So you know, for you, for you, yeah. you're living for others you. with the imagination yeah. that I live this she? life. I live, I've yeah. never really have this other <laughs> life. <laughs> you, 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 are, you are nothing before that. Yeah. yeah. I've always been like. But I think if know? the content isn't really, you know, you can just remove it but I for know. me for me i i, I always say I'm, I'm, I'm a little i'm a little bit cautious on what i post on social yeah, media uh, but me me niko na ile yangu ya kwanza it's still there i, 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 I cannot it. delete it By it's not going anywhere like, <laughs> literally literally went, like everyone mm. all of us went through that sx face so why should I do it? I didn't. You did. Everyone was cancer. We were back in the day when you were all cancer. Zuri, she has confessed. Emma, <laughs> yeah, she has confessed. You were yeah. like Emma, yeah. and you were you were in there. Yeah. Thank you for adding Thank me. Thank you for <laughs> ah, No, 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 I've never done that. <laughs> catch me there, that. catch me there with that. So why am I pleased? Thank you for the ad. <laughs> Thank you for the ad. <laughs> Thank you for the ad. <laughs> this is pride speaking. This is so pride. Pride. Like, I've never done that. Like, Okay, so. Thank you so, yeah, for the answer. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so I, 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 because I don't know, because we, we've seen celebrities put, putting, mm. putting uh, too much, too much of their families out. Some it's because of a choice, mm. but then we've seen these couple goals going south mm. on social media, <laughs> and also there is also the following where everyone believes that the Insta, you, the Insta fame, the uh, for the glam, mm. uh, and for the gram and the, and the glam, whatever it is. Like I think people, I think it's more like you being deciding think, this think, is this is me and this is uh, this is me. It's you, like people seeing a are, different side of you on yeah. social media. It's a perfect life on social media, but in real life it's completely different. Yeah. So if I'm following and trying to portray or like to follow and be uh, as perfect as you on social media, which in actual sense that's not your real you, then people that's why you're having kids getting stressed up all the time and, and doing all manner of crazy mm. things. Why is he laughing? Like oh. to slay. <laughs> no, and, see, because, like how he has said, like yeah. people out here, you are depressing your life because you are you are going through someone's feet, thinking, oh, yeah. this person is having an amazing life. An yeah. Amazing. They are living a much more miserable life than you. Yeah. 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 <laughs> and take faith. Eh? Yeah. You are actually doing better. I know. Yeah. Like I know. people out here are suffering, yeah. but you, yeah. on their feet, you all, go all through the, their feet, you get like, depressed. For men are Dubai, for men are Lamu for holiday. Mm. Mm. Like, you know, alone, you know, Lamu. You go alone, you know, alone, you know, Lamu. Like, you know, alone, you know, Lamu. You go alone, you know, Lamu. You go alone, you know, so I think so I, I, yeah, I think that one brings me to the point that social media always cuts that connection yeah. at some point. Yeah, can, that human connection having that interaction. Yeah, like we have yes, it now. Yeah, it's always that good but it really cuts that connection because for some families they have adopted the a culture that mainly I'm gonna families in Inu Kingia kwa nyumba, simuna yasha mahal. That's good. Then when I get, yeah. we are going to have a one on one conversation. I, I yeah. my kids no, no, no. Because you are eating chocolate in a book, because you are eating chocolate in a book, you are eating Yeah, true. Okay. Oh, someone in the next room, instead of you shall kill or going to knock. So, that's why you are Most families are squeezing man like one of that communication. Yeah, disconnection. Yeah, one of that disconnection is. Most families. Actually, teenagers and parents. Yeah. Because sometimes no, no. you have a phone when you're like, okay, I had a phone that was like in class seven, mm. but it wasn't a smartphone. Wow. Okay, back I then. I don't know. Wow. phone in campus. Really? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah. as I was saying, what I wrote. <laughs> what I wrote. This is what I wrote. This is. Anyway, I also I, I think maybe just the, my last words. I think you know, um, it's a, take maximize the good side of social media, whatever mm-hmm. good side it's for you. Mm-hmm. And also if you can, because I know you are also doing, I know a couple of people, including now so who are trying to, to do a social media detox, mm-hmm. where you decide a couple of hours a day or a couple of days in a week, I'm, yeah. I'm completely not doing social media. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think I think it's a good thing. So probably you will share uh, why you decided. So the question is, why are you detoxing from social media? Mm-hmm. I don't know. Because you don't do much of it. I wouldn't do, I wouldn't call it like, it's a not detox. like a detox. Yeah. It's like trying to control. You know the yeah. the, the whole point about the 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 whole social media scene with apps, smartphones, mm. and whatnot. Yeah. 
it's about companies uh, making building their brands, no, selling their brands mm-hmm. by capturing your time. Like yeah, your time, literally, time, your time true. today is what yeah. they are. And you're not getting a share exactly, of the money. Yeah, they want you to be looking at your on at your screen. Yeah. 24 7 yeah that's how they make money yeah, so true. it's really about reducing how much time yeah i am looking at at my smartphone how much time i'm spending <clears throat> going through my email yeah. or going through my instagram feed and all yeah. that it's really about that it's about limiting it yeah making it okay. healthy yeah. Yeah. Yes. and one way to do it is for the android users i think uh, there's an app it's still on beta but it's called daywise okay. where you download the app and then you you lump your notifications mm. in specific times mm. in ah. a day like I for me I receive four four yeah I have four times of the day where I receive my notifications in batch. Okay. I know the beauty of it is the whole point of where you could be working on something and then you you, you hear your notification sound. Then you are tempted. And then you are distracted. Like, yeah. It's like WhatsApp actually, web is the worst. Mm. Exactly. And I think ever for people. There was, there was, there there was, was yeah, I, I think a study or a research was done that actually said that if you are, maybe you are working, yeah. you are reading and whatnot, yeah. and then you get distracted. Say, it's from, very hard to go yeah, back to where you are. It actually takes an average of 25 minutes 25 to actually minutes. go okay. back. To actually go back, yes, true. Yeah, true. That's, that's so, true. Yeah. Okay. So I think, uh, as you, I also think as someone who has, who has younger siblings and who have, who have, who have smartphones and sometimes you no know, kids are very curious mm. so they just and then we have wi-fi at home or at least they have you know uh, internet on their phones they just you just find them somewhere and it's so hard because i've seen this you 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 echo passwords everywhere i don't know how they find their way either to another app or they find them. i don't know i don't even know i don't even know where these kids are coming from point, nowadays like for example as a parent you have to be no it's how you have said like Today you have to you have to really monitor how your kids because yeah like, I think parental mm, guidance yeah, has to the, be like a, your, a not yeah, child for, for a parent you could be thinking that hey uh, I'm, I have Wi Fi so okay. yeah I have a, a Wi Fi and also on my Wi Fi I have blocked say porn yeah and porn sites and whatnot but then there is but Twitter there is Twitter you like literally porn. your yeah. kid doesn't need to go to porn hub or porn hub and whatnot yeah, just go to on Twitter or Facebook for the, the yeah, yeah, they have not even left the, the app. You the are app. thinking your kids are yeah, on true, Twitter. True, true. So I think yeah. actually for parents, for parents who I think parents from the previous generation, okay, not previous generation, but parents who maybe parents in their forties and fifties, we are not so tech so savvy. tech savvy as as us young people. I think they have to be like just extra. You, I know they don't want to like be on Facebook and WhatsApp, but I think you have for the sake of your kids, you have to. And even for us, because I think our kids will be much smarter than us. No, I think you have to like either try, like try, <laughs> try like have have like alarms or something to like. Yeah, I don't know. Like, just find find a way to I'm to make sure you know. <laughs> I'm like Suhu. I like I gave birth to you at Suhu. Like Kohu. Like I'm a Jamaica. We don't have rights. <laughs> okay, right. We don't have rights in there. First American. of all, we don't even have a right to own that phone. So let's just start, start from there. Uh, let's start from at the right. Your child services. <laughs> like. <laughs> I'm like go go feed yourself. Mm. Like, <laughs> right. You don't mm. be depressed yet. Yeah, mm. right. yeah so but I actually, social, to be social extra. media. It just to add on what so you're saying. It, yeah. does, it takes so much of people's time. Yeah. That is one thing. Yeah. And people always forget that. Time that most of the most of the things and else. information on social media. Yeah. yeah. They are gossip and tablets. Yeah. yeah. You know that? They are not Voices. really that. Yeah. Remember, and then also on top of that, people need also to remember. But the other thing about being on social media platforms is your information. Yes. yes. If someone, uh, people, in case you have watched the the other day the Netflix documentary called The Great Hack. You haven't yet. They, they have actually they actually said that actually information already surpassed even gold and yeah. oil yeah, in true. terms of value. Yeah, we Today, seen, it's yeah. A, yes, Instagram, you are you sign up for a free account. Yeah. But it's really about what information you're giving them. Yeah, giving them. To yeah, or even with the case of Cambridge Analytica and whatnot. Yeah, true. That they were able to profile people based on, based on their Facebook profiles. Mm-hmm. Facebook profiles, yeah. Yeah, they, and it's actually said that they had 5,000 data points yeah. from people. And yeah. actually, if you look, you study those cases, they actually they were able to influence behavior. Yeah, true. So even actually today, people are even asking, are we ever with social Safe. media, how they, it has gotten to? Yeah. Uh, even countries can even countries trust and say that yeah. uh, we are ever going to have say democratic elections yeah, but true. today with mm-hmm. social media yeah. you can literally influence yeah. how the, the morning yeah, exactly I used to think when it comes to information before we just 
consume any information or believe it, we try, you know, just Google and just confirm. Yeah. Or at least wait until you have official information, yeah, sure. maybe from the media houses that maybe you trust that you know, yeah, true. They call someone they, and they, conf- they confirm this. Before you jump into conclusion or into something, just just confirm confirm the information. For me, I think if your life is private, just, just keep it private. private yeah. Yeah. Social media is for social life. Yeah. No, no. If you are someone, maybe you want to. So actually, someone wants to say that for your achievements, yes, you can post them on social media. Yeah. Maybe opportunities yeah. also post yeah, them true, on true, social true. media. Like a job. A job yes, vacancy. but bringing that. I always admire those people who are celebrities, but can strike a balance between their between, private life uh, and also and celebrity life. Exactly. It's it doesn't amazing. really. It's really, really amazing. Because you find that most celebrities or famous people, social media dictates how they live their life. Yeah, true. It's like they are. Directly because they know to each the other. way you dress so, at this party yes. will have a, a very great impact on maybe the next job you're going to get, or maybe what the news will will, will say about you. Also, things they live pretty. Yeah, and people people actually commit suicide for likes. I don't know, I know people. I yeah, know. It's, so it's pretty. It's like pretty, pretty sad. It's if likes were really paying. I know. <laughs> I know. We'd be like tweeting yeah. the whole night. Yeah, but they actually pay. Yeah. Oh, for some people they pay. For some for they do. It, but for, for others, pay. but most people do they pay. <laughs> No, for the one who, you, because you are liking, you don't get paid. But the person that you're liking the content, get get paid. Yeah, I don't know. Okay. Oh, accounts, I don't know. When I give a post to Instagram, I I think I think I'm not going to sell them. What I'm going to do accounts, you have many. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. So. Yeah. But it's an amazing, it's an amazing space. I think it's an amazing space. If you, if you're a business person, please use it to to the maximum. If you're looking for, you know, maybe a partner, maybe that's where you can find your partner there. Uh, if you're just there for the social life information, also, you know, just just the positive thing, yeah. and also minimize the negative as much as you can. For any information, be analytical, analyze it, because I think social media is what you create out of it. Yeah, true. Yes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. From social media, just. Uh, just remember what what you see is is not actually what is. Just remember that. Yeah. Remember the internet never forget. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe and also hit the notification button below. And also on the comment section below, please share your social media uh, experiences. You know the good and the bad. And also if, if there are any new social media platforms that have come up and we didn't mention, please share. We may have a look at them. And also, have you received any, you know, not so good pictures on, on Facebook? Please also, also uh, cyberbullying. <laughs> cyberbullying, actually, actually, cyberbullying is a very good thing. Cyberbullying also, so please share all your experience, the good and the bad. And we'll all learn from you. Thank you, Sandy. Sorry, who was it to rock a camera in a, in a, in a film? No, actually, come on. That's in the river. We're going to have a lot out of frame. Oh, that was your plan. I thought that you were going to have a lot of fun. I thought that you were going to have a lot of fun. I thought that you were going to have a lot of fun.